There we go. Now it's fucking right. We get that first bit. We're here anyway. Pick the beans up. They ate well before their last meal. All right, is it good for you now? So the only thing that's just skipped is just the first bit driving the car, so it's not really important. Wouldn't be that easy, would it? Didn't see any food out there. Leave us alone. This is what we wanted. That's so sad. Poison. Did they give up? They wanted to leave this world together, holding hands in their own home. Will we have a home? We'll see. This opens the lock. <sighs> That's not happening. Okay, so I have to. Do we get to... the key? Mm, it's risky. Might be another way through that door. Let's look around. Let's be smart. That's right. Weird to like glowing up with Cre Clementine when she was a little kid. It's like, okay, what? <laughs> Too small to crawl through. Well, for me. The oh key my God. or the window. Those are our options. It's dark in there. We should kill oh, well, the we're talking about. Um, They're not people. Little Mermaid and how the new one is well, awful. They used awful to be people. It's, it's how they've they changed it people, so much. It's ridiculous. They asked to be left alone. So what's best? Leave them alone, obviously. AJ, I need your help on this one. In there? We need to know if there's food inside. And I need you to be brave. Okay, I can be brave. Good, good. Lift me up. Once you're through, unlock this door. <laughs> Got it. Stay here? We'll see. No one's here. No one's ever anywhere. It's always just monsters. There's a lot of bad people, AJ. Be careful what you wish for. There must be good ones, too. We're good. Just a few. Remember what we said? You know this. Save the last Save the last bullet for myself. That's right. Come on, let's keep looking. There's gotta be something wow. we can eat. Hope Save so. the last bullet for yourself, talking to a kid, like shoot yourself in the head, kid. <laughs> Not the 
worst place to sleep. Not the best, not the worst. Could be better. Um. <sighs> Spoiled. Sorry, buddy. These are long gone. Fuck. <laughs> hey, watch the swears. You said shitbird before. Do as I say, not as I do. Do as I say, Look. not as I do. Hmm. Oh. Stay. Something under here. Hide something. More food. Lots more food. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, it is. We could eat for weeks with this much. It's rigged! That was bad. That was really bad. 
Oh, great, we're upside down. Cool, this is not good. Was the intro? Wow. What is this place? What you playing now? will do.
You got the hiccups. Nothing over here. Fuck you. Okay. <laughs> Boy, he's safe. If you want to see him again, you'll drop that knife. Now. I'm not fucking around. Let's make a deal. You lower yours, I'll lower mine. On the count of three. One. Two. Three. We would have by now, considering the circumstances. I'll let this little standoff slide. But you only get one strike. Now, you're gonna behave so I can take you to see your boy? Because if you really want to fight... Hey, Jay's okay? Take me to him, now. Jesus. You don't bend, do you? All right. Since you asked so nicely. Sorry about... Locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. You were in uh, pretty rough shape when we found you. We had to take precautions, you know, just in case. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. I'm Marlin, that's Tennessee, but uh, call him Ten for short. He's one bit taking care of you. He uh, doesn't talk much. Clementine. Come on, let's go see your boy. Been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? Don't usually see people our age alone out in the wild. I can't imagine what that must have been like. It's taken its toll. Been making a lot of mistakes lately. You saw the car. Don't be so hard on yourself. You lived, didn't you? Found you when we did. 
It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. Walkers were on the way. The car, was it totaled? Yeah. Fuck. Had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. I appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. <laughs> I've seen some rough scenes. Uh, hi there? What's his problem? You're just new. I mean, we haven't seen anything like you in... ever. What is this place? You can probably tell it used to be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well, I am. It probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but we do all right for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses, and good location too. No one really comes out this way anymore. No adults. At all. It wasn't always like this though. People leave, they die. There's less of us all around. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. You and your boy, feels like you both fit that description. It's hard to survive too long these days without being a bit... troubled. I was pretty good as a kid before everything changed. Made a lot of trouble since then. We all had to grow up fast. I'd say that goes double for your boy. It's been a little terror since he arrived. Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Shit. I need to take care of this. Knowing Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. You got bigger fish. The kid's inside. Think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. Get a move on, Willie! Where's your music? damn weapon? Okay. Of a handful, but 
I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. AJ doesn't like people coming up behind him. Don't ever do it. Loud and clear, little man. Thankfully, I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. I'm Lewis. Already oh, found an issue there. Clementine. He started talking and the music was louder than oh, he was talking. Yeah. Yeah, I noticed that too. He kept going when he was like away from it and like, hmm. Yeah. And the music got louder when he started talking, like, he had to. This. <laughs> oh. Um. Double. Um. Does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. Dude! That can't be a good idea. That thing's bigger than him. Is it actually still playing? Yes. Oh, good. He's earned my trust with it. He's lich. Oh my god, that's loud. I taught him who can shoot. He's literally still playing. You guys do your thing, I guess. And he's not even touching the piano. You don't know any others? Well, there is one. But you're armed. It's a ghost. I reckon Lee came back as a ghost and he's playing. <laughs> Gotta be. Hey, Rosie! Where the hell is she? You give her her weapon back? Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. Need our help to clear the way. Seems to be a few more than usual these last couple of days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Bye. What? Just saying. Are you insinuating something? You know, just speculating. Uh, um. Hello, Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. What he said. <laughs> All right, boys and girls, they're starting to fill. Come on. Be careful out there. Don't mind Violet. She uh grows on you. I promise. Oh, this? It's a chair leg. I call it Cheryl's. Wow. Okay. Let me help. 
I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side. There we go. to hold them off much longer. No kidding. Where'd all these walkers come from? We can talk when we're back inside the gates. Keep an eye out for stragglers. You know, you're not half bad, considering the circumstances and all. Thanks. Let's finish these guys off. We don't need them attracting more walkers back to the school. It's all right, girl. It's all right. Hey, see you all and Rosie right. are making friends. Had a bad Rosie. experience with the dog wines. Well, Rosie here can help you get over yeah. it. But she's as cuddly as they come. Oh, except when she's mauling walkers, that is. <sighs> that walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right. Fun's over. Let's get inside. Ah, fucking star. Come out of nowhere. Come out from behind You're not you. the only one. Okay. How to go out there? How do you think it went? Be nice, a sim. Safe stone's nearly dry. I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. We'll talk about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. I'd call that a B plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. <laughs> B minus then. Fuck now, off. Clem here. That was a solid <laughs> A. A plus even. Don't be jealous, Vi. Be better. Um, you kicked ass, Violet. A plus. I know. 
You're both delusional. <laughs> I know. You sound so bored to do the same game like this is great, yeah. Yo, what's up, Tone? Welcome to the stream. Oh, yeah. Currently going through Walking Dead season four. They're pretty good. It's pretty good so far. Come on, y'all. Food piles. <laughs> oh, <laughs> he just hit with the nuts. <laughs> Oh, shit. oh, come on, tough guy. Shake it off. He's a little kid. <laughs> <laughs> a little Shake kid. It off. Mean hook. He can't go around punching people in the. You know what? Expect him to eat at the same table. <laughs> I'll talk to him. Hey. That's funny. Hey. What are you looking at? What's that bird doing? That's gross. He should stop. Gross. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. AJ, I'm sure they'll forgive Marvin. you. But we should go talk to them. But... But I don't think they like me. I can just tell. One ramen shop. They don't. Who name? Who name? I'm scared to oh, talk to anyone. I just sat there. <laughs> AJ, listen. We haven't eaten for days. The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you really want to go back out there? No. So we should apologize to Marlin. Right now? Well, we can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. Help AJ make friends, radio. Mmm, yes. Hey guys. Glem, AJ, this is Omar. Eh, excuse me. Chef Omar. Hello, and no, it's yeah, not ready. Yeah, punch some dude in the nuts. Omar's a perfectionist. <laughs> the slightest flavor out of place, and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat, or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. I'll let you guys know when we're done. Okay. It walks away. Yo, dude. Hello. Hello? Oh, hey. It's you two. Clementine, right? Yep. A sim, right? Hey. What are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Hmm. Like a diary? I try to think of it more like a history book. Those who do not learn from the past and all that. <sighs> you seemed mm -hmm. really mad at Marlin back there. He keeps pulling back the safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt. Which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the hun hunting party come back. She. Hey, zip it! That is not yours to read, kid. Give it back. It was just sitting there. AJ, give it back to him. Okay. Thank you. This thing is the only place I get any real privacy around here. I gotta preserve what I can, you know? I gotta finish this before dinner. Not to be. Like rude, but you know. Bye. Not to be rude, but you know, bye. Um. Okay. <laughs> Not to be rude, but you know, go away. <laughs> There's that girl up it. Yeah. Want to talk to her? You mean, say I'm sorry? Yes. She's scary and always seems so mad. You can do it. You just gotta...
Oh, whoops. <laughs> I'll make something up. <laughs> you, you just gotta... Yes. If you like, you can fight me nothing. back. We're good, Chuck. <laughs> I you did it. Like, you can you fight sure did. Me back. I'm sorry. What? <laughs> what? What? <laughs> you make friends yet? Can we leave yet? I'm not ready. Not yet. Okay. Let's talk to someone else. Who else left to talk to is the question. Hey. Hey, you're new. I am. I'm carving a weapon. Uh, uh yeah. Okay, I can good. see that. You're good at that. You like that, huh, little dude? You wanna see something cool? I wanna see. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty rad, huh? That's how you fuck up some monsters. Swear. Uh, I'm sorry. Ha. Ha ha. Ha ha. <laughs> hey guys. Knock it off, Ten. Heard you guys didn't have the best introduction. It wasn't my fault. Ten. I really am sorry. Really. I'm sorry, too. What is this? Our graveyard. You guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who's buried here? Nobody, really. This is where we buried Ten Sister's belongings. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost them, both about a year ago. Paying respects. Should we do that too? Maybe? Yeah, I think that'd be a very nice thing to do, AJ. Come on. Thank you. Welcome. Clem? Mm -hmm. Yeah? I'm ready. To talk to Marlin. Okay. Do it. Clementine, right? I'm Brody. He's a sweet little fella. Figured there ain't a lot of room for sweetness still out there. Yeah, he is pretty sweet. Not everybody sees that. I won't pay them no mind if you won't. Good to know. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? Don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. You, a regular heavyweight. Hey, Clem! AJ! Stew's done! You guys earn your supper after all. Ladies and gentlemen, dinner is served. <sighs> Thanks. Wow, can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Mm. 
This is really good. Mm. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Where are your manners, AJ? <laughs> Good night. Good night. Clem. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sure they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. I'm full, kiddo. You can have the rest. You sure? You bet. <sighs> I'm all done. Mm-hmm. Me too. Now what? I'll tell you what. Time for something very important. Oh, God. Good night. Violet, it's time. What's the game tonight, Lou? War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast alike. The only game there is. I don't know the game. The only card game I've played had less people. Don't worry. You'll pick it up as we go. It's easy. Oh, okay. Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner gets to ask Clem a question. Hmm. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. And what if I win? Then you okay. get to ask us one. It's only Yo, what's fair. Up, Brad? Wait, what about what? AJ? What about him? Looks like he's made a friend. Dead. Finally finish it. Come on. Hope you're having a you good take day. take your eyes off him for one card game. But you both could use a break from each other. Yeah, maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. Sometimes yeah, right. he acts Thank you for that, more like an adult than a kid. It. It's nice Welcome to see to him act like a little boy Welcome again. Welcome to the family. Or to the clan. Plus, if you would. Community. Yeah. Madhouse, yeah, welcome to the madhouse. <laughs> Way to go, me. So, about AJ. Where are AJ's yeah, parents? Yeah, what about AJ? You two don't really look related, uh, so... Uh, oh. What happened there? They're dead. They didn't make it. They were nice people. For right. the most part. It makes sense. He's a nice kid. For the most part. Hey, I win. Hey, you do. So, what do you want to know? Everything. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Uh, what's the grossest, grossest thing, thing you've, you've ever, ever eaten? eaten? It's pretty easy. Uh, Go. horse eyeballs. Slugs. Oh, uh. come on. Dude, I fucking horse hate eyeballs. cantaloupe. I ate a guy's mm. leg once. I'm kidding. <laughs> the look on her face. Are you? <laughs> I ate a guy's leg once. Booyah! Nope. <laughs> I'm kidding, are you? Are Come you on, really? spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh, ever have a boyfriend? <laughs> oh, oh my god. 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 What? Yourself. It happened. Perfectly valid question. No. You can ask me if I've ever had a girlfriend. A boyfriend. I haven't, uh, by the way. Oh, I'm sure she's real surprised about that one. There was I one. Met a boy one time. And and we were friends. Just friends. Yep. Nothing else? Nothing at all? Huh. No. He was such a huge dork. Oh, dude, you fucking loved him, huh? No. This is adorable. <laughs> uh, I win. So Clem, you can't have been yes. alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? Family? Anyone? The first person who taught me about survival was Lee. <laughs> you know, Lee. What'd he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? How to say goodbye.
I win again. You do indeed. Ask away. What's up with your haircut, Marlin? Oh boy. Uh, <laughs> what do you mean? She means looks like a dead cat. Probably smells like one too. <laughs> uh, I look cool. <laughs> Whatever you say. I say I, I look, look cool. cool. <laughs> Victory Violet. Here's something I love to ask when I'm in groups. <clears throat> Go on. Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die mm. first? Hmm, that is fucked up. Hmm, <laughs> oh, I know. I don't know, you, probably? Why probably? You asked a morbid <laughs> question, <laughs> there's your morbid answer. Oh, shit. Boom. Fuck you. <laughs> I am the greatest card player of all time. Just ask your damn question. Ever? Actually, never mind. What? Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Ever had to kill someone you loved? Lewis. Hey, she yeah. wanted me to ask. Yeah. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That sounds like a rough day. <sighs> yeah, worst day of my life. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah, it's probably for the best. You wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Long day, huh? Yep, real long. <laughs> I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. You guys relax. Get some sleep. I'm human for a night. In the morning, come find me Thanks, and talk about making this long term. We can stay? We can talk about it. That looks like a really safe window. It does. I didn't have it in the first place. Good. <laughs> this box has so many colors. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. Those pictures. You mean like 10? Yeah, like 10. Huh. But I like to do pictures too. Oh, shit. I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Where the hell is it? Oh. What? That's what I was looking for. It belonged to Sophie. Uh, Ten oh. sister. He was asking for oh. more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry. We didn't know. No, no. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. it's fine. Don't mm -hmm. don't worry mm -hmm. about it. Mm -hmm. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the so past good. year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's it's fine. It's all right. She says you can keep it. Okay. Oh, a disappointed ten. Fuck. Oh well. Huh. I see you're um, settling in. Yep. Yeah. Is that okay? Sure. 
I guess. I always liked this room. Sophie had, like, paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of <clears> color. <throat> and Minerva. She was really musical. Not like Lewis, though. She had actual talent. No, <laughs> <laughs> oh, actual talent. She had the most amazing voice. Oof. Real bluesy. Oof. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. After they... Afterwards, Brody and Ten took down all the paintings and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. No, oh, they sound like they were great friends. Yeah, Sophie was a good friend. And Minnie, uh, Minnie. we were close. Me and her. Good Minnie Mouse? He's from the What mouse? exactly happened to them? Sophie and Minerva. They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. It happens. Honestly, I just miss having someone around to talk to. There's just so many dudes. This place can get a little too bro town for my liking sometimes. Mm -hmm. And I'm not exactly like a people person, you know? I know I sometimes have a habit, have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. Yeah, me too. First impressions aren't exactly my strong suit either. Oh, right. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. Not bad, kiddo. Hey, Clem, look at me. I'm an artist. I'm a, I'm a computer. I should be getting back. Enjoy the art supplies, little man. What a cool girl. She cool. See ya. Yeah, see ya. Bye. Okay, Alvin Jr. Time for bed. Okay. Here. For me? For the wall. To make our home look nice. That's a good idea, AJ. I remember in the three, in the one version of this, the other version, you have How to collect all of AJ's here. drawings and that, and all the collectibles and that, and it's really annoying because you've got to pick different specific choices to get certain achievements. It's like, ugh. Uh, Why? AJ? Yeah, it's annoying. Especially with this final season, it's just like, you got to do this and this, and then make, pick this choice, and then pick this choice, and don't disappoint this person. Hey there. Like, really? What are you doing? This is where I'm going to sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. You're gonna get cold down there. The bed's a lot warmer. What about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? Nobody's gonna come in. Trust me. That girl just came in. If I stay here, no one can find me. And I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> hey, what's gotten into you? Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. AJ, listen to me. It's gonna be okay. Please just give the bed a chance. It's soft and warm. I think you'll really like it. <sighs> this bed is really soft. Told you so. It's really, really soft. Told you so. Ha <laughs> ha. Good night, AJ. Clem? Hmm? This place is nice. I'm glad we found it. Me too. Sleep in their clothes. What? He's 
gonna let us stay, right? I guess we're gonna find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. How do you know where he is? It was fast. Up here. Come on, Clem, okay. this way. Hey, I'm AJ, coming. wait up. All right. doing I was looking for more pencils but I wasn't able to find any who are these guys they are firefighters that one's a policeman she's gonna save the day but what are they they these were the people who protected us where are they I've never seen one before Gone. They all died a long time ago, trying to save everyone. Oh, they were weak. What? No, they were brave, strong. Now, give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. You don't even know what they are. Okay, okay, that's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. It's mine. No, it's not. Ugh, fine. Thanks. Do you know where Marlin is? AJ's a little brat. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. What'd you find? It's a picture of Marlin and Lewis. They're so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? Marlin? <laughs> Stay back. Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. <laughs> Sit, girl. See? She's harmless. She just needs to get to know you is all. Here. I'll show you. Do you trust me? down, Rosie. state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. What's the trap area? The hunting grounds, more or less. 
Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and a Sam are set to go check them today. That's the only road that leads in and out of Erickson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but <laughs> took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. The greenhouse? Oh, uh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. I had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. how much forest surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part, anyway. What's out here? Oh, that's where we fish. Uh, I got a shack for storage right here, right along the river. It's secure, mostly. Get the occasional walker or two come by. Vi and Brody should be heading out there in a bit. That's the train station. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car? Pretty sure that place a lost cause. There's a hell of a lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. Walkers flooded in there after all the noise you made. One more thing. See these red lights? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years, and the food's become more scarce. So, why not go outside it? Someone goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just. <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if I know. If I don't fix our food situation, <laughs> I can't lose anyone else. We've already lost so much. Friends. It might be, yeah. Uh, siblings, Because you're not supposed to hear it at this point. Kid die. I get it. I know when I'm talking to this dude, friend. or I yeah. did it on the you other version. Quite at my 30, you'll know how I feel. Um, I couldn't <gasps> hear the music huh. at all, so I think it might be a glitch. Yeah, Sorry. an audio glitch. Didn't mean to come off like a dick. Everyone's counting on me to step up, be the leader they need me to be. Yeah, well, I'll just do this and turn the music off because it's it's, it's annoying. Uh, music volume. Why would you do that? I really want to be that for them. There you go. You and AJ are two uh, more mouths to feed. Maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds. If I turn it off completely, what would happen? Will you ever still hear it? Right. Looking for rabbits. Well, a sim will, anyway. Lewis, uh... Is it, you can hear it now? He shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. Yeah, so that turned off. Hopefully, Works. those two get along long enough to get some work done. Both teams... I think it's an audio glitch in, the, in this game where it just keeps playing, no matter what room you're in. We're gonna go fishing. Okay. Take this. There's an achievement. There's an, the, the annoying thing is, Thanks. those two choices are picked between the two. On the other version, there's a different achievement Just remember for each to stay one. You gotta in replay the it to do the other one. Need you to come back home annoying. One piece. So that means we could stay? What? Do you think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat, you're both welcome here. Go get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. Let's do it. See you around. See you around, bread. You know, I've been thinking. 
I wish we could all go on a road trip together. Road trip? Why bother? It's not like there's anything worth seeing anymore. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Are you sure you trust my driving? I promise I don't usually crash. <laughs> oh, right. On second thought. Yeah, I think Clem just totaled the last working car in the world. So much for your road trip. Are we going to the car? No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the car. <laughs> I'm sick of the car. That's funny. I wish this old rust bucket was still working. We could just jump in and start driving. We could take turns sitting in the back. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. We'd run out of gas eventually. But still, it's fun to imagine, isn't it? <laughs> Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted. If gas wasn't an issue. Or a busted carburetor or flat tires or the transmission. Buzzkill. You know, I think I'd drive through the heart of a city. Somewhere big, like New York. All the lights and the beautiful buildings. I wouldn't even know where to start. Yeah, oh yeah. The biggest city in the world. I'm sure that's nice and safe. I've I lived here nice my entire life. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kind of like to unknow it. No use dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, I guess we should get to work on those fish. We got spears inside the mm -hmm. shack. Come on. You go ahead. I'll stay out here. Where are those spears? Hey, about by. I'm sorry she's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed Sophie and Minnie. They were really close with Vi, and I think she blames me for what happened to them. I mean, mm. how do you even apologize for something that fucked up? I don't know. Maybe I deserve it. You should talk to her about it. I'm sure she'll listen. <sighs> yeah, right. I tried. I have. It just never seems like the right time. We all used to be friends. <sighs> Guess I just kind of miss that. But when you showed up, I don't know. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone in a long time. Hmm. Hmm. Do you? I mean, I hate to ask this of you, but do you think you could talk to her? See how she feels? About me? It's just been eating me up inside. Look, I don't think I should get involved. It sounds like you two should just talk it out yourselves. Oh, right. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, it was stupid of me to ask. I'm gonna go check our fish traps downstream. Hey, what the hell is taking you two so long? See? I'll take this to Vi. There should be some extras lying around. Okay. Cool. Ready to get some fish? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Can I join you? Sure. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess I don't realize it makes them easier targets. I wanna try. Take a spear. Go nuts. Go ahead and try. They're not running. I 
any luck? I got something. Good enough for me. Hey, I'm sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. Seeing someone else in there, uh, it was harder than I expected. You'd think I'd be less sentimental by now. I understand. There are people I still miss too. It never really gets easier. Yeah. It really doesn't. Okay. God. Sometimes she just gets on my last nerve. You know? Yeah, I can tell. I mean, it's it's not like I hate her. I just... <clears throat> I wish we could all go on a road trip together. God, she's so... Oh. She definitely thinks you hate her. Looks like they wisened up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. Me, Steve. I got one! Clem, I got one! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is between us. With Brody. I don't know why it's like this. Hmm. Why is it so weird? I can never relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. Because you make it weird. Brody tries and you just make fun of her. Ouch. I guess I better do some self-reflection. <laughs> Burn. <laughs> we because should get going. Her. Boom. You guys catch any fish? We caught some, but not a lot. Please. I didn't get anything. We should catch up with Lewis and the Sim. See if they had any better luck. Well, you gonna lead the way? Oh, uh... Yeah. Follow me. It's not too far from here. Okay. Noise, noise, noise. Where are those guys? Clem, look. Someone cut it. Is that normal? Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. A Sam? Lewis! <sighs> Let's spread out. Maybe that'll help us find him. Watch out for monsters. Hmm. Empty. Huh. Is this a Bible page? Clem, found something. Monster. Guys, over here! Well, we didn't kill this one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? Where have you been? Checking nearby traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. <sighs> Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's just... Fuck. It's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. It's just a panic attack. Take a second. 
Breathe in deep and hold it. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Excuse me? <laughs> Whoa. I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. <laughs> you guys figure it out. We still need food, you know, to live. Just FYI. Basic human need. I'll take this food. all back to school. And maybe we can ration out something. So what do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. Will Marlin kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find well, out. Where else could we look? <sighs> Let me think. The train station. It's not too far from here. Maybe, but it's outside the safe zone. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. Or we could starve. Fine. Let's go. There. That's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. We're gonna die. It's either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem, maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. Hmm. We barely got out of here. It was close. Sounds scary. There's a reason. We need to get in there somehow. Maybe there's another way in. We could climb up there, but I don't know how that would get us inside. That bell might be able to get the walker's attention. They do like to follow sound. You look like you've got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it... Lewis, I vote Lewis. Uh, hold on. I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. Come on, Lou. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. I think you mean charming and theatrical. Okay, Prince Charming. Let's see those talents in action. I can't say no to a face like that. Hmm? I'll go with you. Mm -hmm. Give you some cover. Fine. I'll do it. But if I die, I'm making sure Walker Lewis eats both of you first. I'll distract okay, him until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then, I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck! Thanks. Oh, whoops. Oh, okay. I, you are dead. No, no. okay. Ready again? Whoops. <laughs> yeah. Hey, ugly! No, not you. Not you either. Sit! Fine. Make you some music right now. Alright, she's alive. No. Alright, someone's down. Ready? Nobody? 
second. We may not have a second. I'll watch the door for walkers. Okay, AJ and I will sneak in, grab the food, and get out. Sounds good. Let's make it quick. Let's go. You did. There's some more left of is alive. These will be perfect. Plim, look. Try it out. See if it works. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Nice. Just in case. Just in case. Job, AJ. Is there more? Keep it coming. Well, I was out of nothing. That's kind of funny. Stand. Slowly. Don't yell. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. If I don't have to. Who are you? The name's Abel. And I'm hungry as hell. Abel? You and your friends made a lot of noise out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? You knew about this place already and organized some effort to get inside. I've seen those cigarettes before. You messed up our traps, didn't you? Guilty as charged. But it was an honest mistake. Mm. I can be a real butterfinger sometimes. You look a little young to be out on your own. You got a group? Count you plus the two outside, I'm thinking maybe more? We're a big group. Strong people, well armed. Uh huh. Right, right. And this big, strong group sends the kids out to do the risky work. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. Well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? Now that's impolite. Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. 
I can kill you, you know. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. Listen up, Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go my merry. You understand? I'm just gonna take a little bit, then I'm leaving. Like it never happened. AJ, lower the gun. Clem, he's stealing our food. Alvin Jr., now! Wise woman. Clem, we're running out of time. We need to get out of here. Don't panic. I was just leaving. Thanks for dinner. Who in the fuck was that? Just take a bag and fill it up. At least I'll have to get some. Loading forever. Literally, come on, load. You are not listening to me, Marlon. Listen to me. I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it. Took y'all a while. How poor are they that have not the patience? A Sim! Mitch! Check it out! Food! That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. <laughs> I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. Like, seriously, it's a lot. Lewis and Violet helped too. Neither of them ever brought back this much before. Neither have you. <laughs> Neither you have you. Elvis? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty ass Radio Bible cigarettes. Creep. He had weird, different colored eyes. Did he follow you? No, I let him have some food and then we lost track of him in a swarm of walkers. You just let him take our food? What the fuck? Yep. Now he knows we're out here and he'll come back for more. Ooh. What the Ooh. hell were you thinking? This is fucked. How could you be so stupid? Hello? We have food. What else matters? <laughs> just Everything sat, like, quiet. else matters. I, I just can't. I won't. Just not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means. Enough. Just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food. It's happened before. You are overreacting. You can't be serious. Come on, let's go somewhere and talk about this. If anything happens, I'm holding you responsible. Okay, crazy bitch. Clem, I know I asked you for help. You did. You did. You did. But shit. God, nothing's easy. It was risky, but it was worth it. 
Like you said, we can't lose another kid. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I did say that. You did. <laughs> well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Um, I'll go talk to Brody. Oh, so, uh, you're welcome. Thanks for the haul, Clem. You guys should go enjoy it. You've earned it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't sweat it, Clem. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out oh. by anything that happens past the safe zone. She'll be all right eventually. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. Okay, bye. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get Rip. to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. Dying's not scary. I mean, it's wow. sad, but not scary. Are you kidding me? Dying is the scariest thing there is. When you die, you turn into a monster. Maybe. All I know is that if Minnie were here, she'd tell them to quit the theatrics. <laughs> I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now instead. Sophie was awesome at making stuff. That's She'd cool. build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it too. And Minnie'd be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess that doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. Someplace safe and happy. Bad people don't wind up there. I don't know. They might let in a few. And Minnie and Sophie always like the bad guys in stories. Hmm. Who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably look. Talking about heaven. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. But sometimes, I draw this too. Can... can I be there? Sure. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. Sure, why not? Oh, I almost forgot. Here you go. It's yours. It's ours. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. Hmm. Another loading screen. Love the loading screens. Time for bed, little guy. Can I stay up? Nope. Two more minutes. Tell you what, you lay down, and then we'll see. You full from dinner? Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was. I like it here. I got to kill fish. Violet didn't look like she was having fun. But I did. It 
it's nice not driving everywhere or running away. But the ranch was nice too, before the blood. This isn't the ranch. Do you like it? I like it, now that I'm used to it. I do, I really do. It's good to feel safe somewhere. Clem. Yeah? You let that mean man go at the station. You let him take food from us. It wasn't right. I didn't like it. Don't be mad at me for saying that, though. Him getting away with a little food kept things from getting violent. You have to know when to fight, AJ, and this wasn't the time. It's still not right to let someone take from us. It makes us soft. So you're so tough, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Who's Mr. Softy now? <laughs> Stop! <laughs> That's what I thought. There. You gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right, give me a minute. Good night, sleep tight. Don't let a walker bite. And if they try, I never let them bite. Come on, play it right. One time, bang. Good work, and thanks. There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? No, 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 not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. You got your gun. Uh-huh. I'll be right back. Stay safe. Besides, can't pick it. I have to find another way to the basement. A cellar door out in the yard.
another entrance to the basement around here. Find the cellar door, okay. No, wrong way. Wrong way. Jimmy, wrong way. What? Oh, wrong way. playing that puzzle game. Just talking. Go get some sleep. 
deserve some shut-eye. You had a busy day. You're not getting rid of me that easily. Tell the others what. Please, this is a private conversation. <clears throat> okay? It doesn't concern you. Oh, it does. The man you met at the station! We got history. Brody! Don't listen to her, Clem. She's acting crazy. She gets this way sometimes. She's just got to tune it out. Let her speak, asshole. Uh, excuse me? I want to hear what she has to say. How do you know that guy? Marlon let him take the twins. Him and his people. Brody! Ten sisters. I thought they were killed by walkers. That's the story we told everyone. Shut up! Because Marlon was so ashamed of what- Shut up! Oh, shit. Huge buildings. Lights. Clem, you're in danger. You and H.A. Bull. What danger? Marlon will kill me if I tell. He's scared. And when he's scared, he gets angry. Brody, if there's a threat to A.J., you have to tell me. Everything is so faint. I can't feel my legs. Please, try and focus. If those raiders come back, said he'd let him take you. Take us? To make him go away. <laughs> like he did. <laughs> like he did with ten sisters. <laughs> Brody. <laughs> oh, fuck. No. What the hell am I gonna do? What do you gonna do? Go fucking put it down, idiot. Marlin! Oh, shit. Marlin, you son of a bitch! Don't do this! I'm sorry. I can't let you talk to the others. God damn it! Marlin! Something really thin. I could force it in there and lift up the latch. Can't find mm. anything in this dark. Yes, flashlight. That'll help. work. Totally is turning into Resident Evil.
Oh. Oh. Why Brody? Did you see it happen? Is she a walker now? Hey, Marlin! You might want to get your story straight. Clem! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head... That's a lie! I saw you kill her! What the hell is going on? Look at her hands! She's covered in Brody's blood! We saved their lives when anyone else would have kept walking. We fed them, we kept them warm, and this is how they thank us! Guns being pulled and murder! Well, fuck them! Fuck! Marlin! Jesus Christ! Screw you, Marlin! Oh, I'm dead, dead. Okay, it's not attacking. Right, gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. AJ, put the gun down. Get this fucking psycho away from me! Where is she? <laughs> <laughs> She's in the basement. She murdered Brody. What? Is that blood on your face? Why Brody? Did you see it happen? Is she a walker now? Hey, Marlin! You might want to get your story straight. Clem! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head split open! That's a lie! I saw you kill her! What the hell is going on? Look at her hands! She's covered in Brody's blood! Oh, shit. Jesus Christ, Clap, what did you do? she talking about? Don't do it, because he needs us alive. Shut up! Brody told me Marlin was gonna give me and AJ up to Raiders in exchange for safety. The same way he gave up Sophie and Minnie. Wait. Oh my god. Shut the fuck up, Clementine! Let her talk! Brody told me the truth, and that's when Marlin killed her! Oh, come the fuck on! They only met up with these Raiders because Clem insisted they go out there. Quite the coincidence, isn't it? Shame, I don't believe in those. 
first thing she did was attack you, Ten. Think about how scared we all were when the adults left. I pulled us out of that fear. I gave us all courage again. Who are you all gonna believe, huh? Johnny come lately and a little fucking lunatic? Or me? Fred? She did help us get food. What good is food if a group of outsiders is just gonna come along and take it? You have to believe me. You don't! You met her like two days ago! I don't know you, Clem. Not really. What? I'm sorry. So you'll let Marlin shoot me? Seriously? Don't let her get in your head. Hey, what did he want you to do? She was my friend, too. So was Brody. Clem, I... <sighs> Shit. It will all feel safer once I pull this trigger. You were there that day those raiders came? He would have abandoned you two! Yeah, my relationship with Why would it be difficult? Why am I not surprised? Put down the gun now. We're gonna do this the right way. Stand down, Mark. Be reasonable. You don't get it. You, you don't understand at all, do you? I'm trying to protect you! All of you! Every fucking one of you! He's lying to you! He can't or won't protect you! Look what happened to Brooke! To Sophie! Minerva! You suck at protection! Shut your fucking mouth! I made the right call! I saved the lives of everyone in this fucking school! They came back, I do it again! Excuse me? I didn't realize we were so fucking expended. They dick told me they died! I had to save the rest of you, okay? You gave my sisters away. <laughs> Why would you do something like that? I trusted you, Marlin. They trusted you. Easy, because he's a coward. I wanted to get them stage some kind of rescue. Honest, Ted, I just couldn't. I was, I was too afraid. You killed Brody because she knew. <laughs> I didn't mean to. I didn't want this. I wanted to save all of you. Sophie. Minerva. You're pathetic. <laughs> Is it true? No, it is. You were just the only one who couldn't see it. I know I betrayed you. All of you. Just let me leave. You'll never have to see me again. Just let me become a bad memory. Just give me that. If you really think... What? I saved one for me. Shot with the fucking head. 
He just shot with the head. He just shot him with the fucking head. <laughs> oh my god. That's insane. Yeah, what I think I'll do is I'll pick the rest of this up, two, three, four, up later on today. I'm tired. Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm. Tomorrow evening, you gotta do what? Three and four, or two, three, four. That shouldn't be too bad. <laughs> <laughs> 